two-stroke IC engines. Two-stroke IC engines were the introductory type engines used since long back. Now they are not widely used as they have a lot of disadvantages. Nowadays mainly four-stroke engines are used. Two-stroke engines are of two types, the SI spark ignition engine and CI compression ignition engine. First let us look at the two-stroke SI engine working. Two-stroke SI engine. The name two-stroke SI engine comes from the fact that there are only two strokes required for the engine to complete one cycle and produce power. In the diagram shown, we can see that a typical two-stroke engine consists of an exhaust port, an intake port or transfer port, the piston, connecting rod, an inlet reed valve and a crank connected to the crankshaft. The piston covers and uncovers the transfer port and exhaust port during its movement at the required timing. Now let us assume that the piston is now residing near the top dead center and the space between the piston head and the cylinder head is filled with the compressed fuel air mixture which is drawn in the previous stroke. At this time the exhaust port would be covered by the piston like a door covering an opening. During this period the fresh air fuel mixture from the intake reed valve manifold rushes into the cylinder casing and fills the crankcase. Now during the power stroke the piston moves from the top dead center towards the bottom dead center due to the expansion of the air fuel mixture compressed in the previous cycle. When the piston moves downwards the exhaust port is uncovered giving the exhaust gases a chance to escape into the atmosphere. During this time the air fuel mixture previously sucked into the crankcase is thrown upwards towards the cylinder head through the narrow gap in between the cylinder vault and the piston. The transfer region due to the swirling action created by the rotation of the crank. Now when the piston again moves upwards during what is known as the compression stroke the inlet port is covered and during the same time the fresh air fuel mixture is compressed and exhaust gases are removed. At the end of the compression, a spark plug residing at the top of the cylinder introduces a spark which ignites the air fuel mixture thus creating a high pressure of the piston to expand. The removal of the exhaust gases with the help of the fresh air fuel mixture is known as scavenging. This is the working principle of two-stroke SI engine. Two-stroke diesel engine. In the case of a two-stroke diesel engine, the only difference is that instead of the air fuel mixture, only air is introduced into the cylinder through the intake port. During the compression stroke, diesel is sprayed into the compressed volume with the help of an injector. All the remaining steps are the same. In almost all the two-stroke engines, there will be a deflector at the top of the piston to facilitate easy movement of the air or the air fuel mixture towards the top dead center.